Okay, before I get into the question, I want to point out that breaking rope is the hardest thing I've had to draw so far. With that, number 13 says a crate of mass M equals 25 kilograms rides on the bed of a truck attached by a cord to the back of the cab as in the figure. The cord can withstand a maximum tension of 63 newtons before breaking. Neglecting friction between the crate and the truck bed, find the maximum acceleration the truck can have before the cord breaks. It's in meters per second squared. So here's the deal. If we have a force of, of the truck pulling on this, in 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 this direction then the 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 crate is also pulling on the truck in the opposite direction with the opposite force and so we can dis we can discern what the force is by taking the weight so force e or not the weight but the mass but force equals mass times acceleration so the mass of the crate times its acceleration will give us the force and so we want to find our maximum acceleration with, for a given force. So acceleration equals force divided by mass. And so the given force that we have is 63 newtons. So A equals 63 newtons over some mass. It gives us the mass as 25 kilograms. So the maximum acceleration we can have is 63 over 25. It's 2.52 meters per second squared. So 2.52 meters per second squared. If there is no friction, now if there is friction then we would it would be it would be higher than that. You could accelerate faster um, because the friction would help stabilize the crate and it wouldn't just be the rope pulling on it. So there you go. That's a fast one, so uh two minutes.